Oh, hold on. Is, am I mic'd? Is my mic on? Check, check, yeah, check. Wait, wait, wait. It's okay. Check, check. Yeah. Is that it? We're good. Okay. What's up, everyone? Welcome back to Tea Gardens TV. Today, we're going to talk about the part two of the alternative products in case there's a ban happening. Um, it's already in the talks. We, we're not sure what's happening yet. We did a first video with an alternative video one. I'll link that video at the end of this video. But this video here is part two because we missed something and we wanted to just bring it up to your awareness and your attention, okay? Uh, if you're already reading the title, yes, it is the Puff Crush. Um, what does that mean? Come on over here, Sammy. So the Puff Crush are these little plastic pods, all right? Oh, it's a plastic container, but inside are silicone pods, okay? So if I pull them right off, you can kind of see that's rubbery. It just slips right over um, a, a bar of some sort or even your jewel at, uh, in this case, okay? So uh, it's a crush because you have to crush the tip of it. Let me see if I can get some sound over here for you guys, a little crush. So once you crush it, that's how you activate the flavor pods, okay? They're not really pods, they're silicone slip-ons something like that. So I'm going to just crush it here so you can hear it. Where's my mic? There you go. You guys got that. And you can smell it. It's very pungent in flavor. It's very fruity. This one here in my hand is the sour apple. Now, Puff Crush does make it in a eight flavor. I only got four right now, so I'm just going to show you the four. Uh, okay. Puff Crush. And everything else is here. They have it in watermelon, which is called lush. They have it in mango, and they also have it in strawberry kiwi. Okay, I like sours. I'm a sour guy, so sour apple is great, and then maybe kiwi, strawberry as well too. Okay, guys. So um, now we found it best to taste the flavor. We we taste the flavor better, in other words, when it comes to just using a um, menthol bar. That means no flavor, just menthol, okay? Um, now, obviously, it, it, moving forward, if the ban does go through and there's no flavors um, in the market, you can get yourself a menthol or even a puff clear, okay? Puff bar makes a flavor, flavorless called clear, uh, and that clear is just no flavor, okay? And this, I think these guys will do really well with that, okay? These little uh, crushed silicone slip-on uh, flavored um, pods, you can call them, or, you know, slip-on silicone, whatever you want to call them. Um, but the menthol has the best flavor. We did try it with a jewel tobacco, okay, a classic tobacco, and we slipped it right on. Look how it fits. Fits really snug there. Okay, so that's how the jewel, um, menth, uh, jewel classic tobacco flavors um, fit on, okay? So you guys can, uh, obviously it, it's more personal preference here. I can't give you any suggestions right now too much. You guys have to try this on your own. I'm busy, leave. And um, so wanted to just um, give you guys an update on kind of the two um, ways of this, uh, utilizing these flavors here, okay? So if, every, if everybody here is all about flavor. I think this video could be for you guys. Now, I'm going to add this other part into the video where in case, because a lot of people are saying, you know what, I'm just going to quit. I'm done with it, this and that. And you guys still want that oral fixation satisfaction of just puffing on something without nicotine. That's also another option I have in front of me here. The ripples, okay? These ripple vape bars all right there's no nicotine they're nicotine free and they're also vegan based they're formulated in the uk and they're also organic what does that mean so in here are still the pgvg and it's going to have essential oils i'm going to read some off to you guys okay so these are all for the quitters all right you guys ready <laughs> so they got boost here and what promotes that name boost is going to be the lychee aroma okay the green tea and maca maca root there okay so that's the essential oil in here so a, a different alternative i'm not going to say healthier or better or anything of that nature it still gives you oral fixation um, on drawing on something it gives you that nice uh throat hit but the only one that gives you throat hit is the peppermint aroma there which is power i believe right is that right sammy mm -hmm. cool power so this one has peppermint 
aroma in there and the two um, herbs that is involved with this uh, uh, bar here is the ginseng and then ginkgo biloba. Okay, so those, those herbal ingredients promotes the power behind the name. All right, and you got relax, okay, which is a jasmine flavor followed by chamomile and lemon balm, all right? So these are for the quitters. These are all for people trying to get off of it. Still want something and they just can't quite pull 100% away yet. This will kind of uh, ease you out of this, all right? So th the last one is dream. And uh, the dream also is gonna be lavender aroma. So the lavender essential oil uh, with valerian root and jujube seed, okay guys? Um, so this here is going to be an alternative here. This, I also mentioned this in my previous video, which I told you I'm going to put in the end of this video here. Okay. So um, if you guys have any other suggestion, please comment below, help everyone out in the community uh, that might be pulling their hair. Okay. In regards to possibly um, wondering where this, which direction this vape band is going to go and what kind of flavors will be available and or not be available. Um, so I wanted to just raise some awareness to you guys that this is another alternative that I missed in my first video. These crush puff pods. Are they pods? They're not even pods. They're just silicone slip-ons. Let's call them silicone slip-ons. I, I don't want to brand or start using these names as pods because they could be mis very misleading here, okay? So, you know, we, we got to be really careful when it comes to the terminology here. Um, it could get mis misleading. So let's just call it silicone slip-on, flavored silicone slip-ons, all right? Uh, they come in eight flavors again. If you have any questions, comment below. We'll get back to you guys there. If you guys have urgent questions, you can call the vape support. We're going to put the number below our description in this video here in the YouTube channel. Um, if you found this informative, share with a friend or family. If you want to stay up to date, subscribe, click on the bell notification to get alerted because subscribing won't give you alerts, okay? So there's two, there's a bell next to the subscribe button. And if you're, you live in Los Angeles and you want local delivery, we do have one hour delivery. Um, phone number is going to be below. Just call us. We'll make an order. We'll, we'll uh, Postmate it directly to you. We're not on Postmate, so don't go to Postmate. Just order from us all over, over the phone. We request the drivers to come to your house and drop it off within an hour. Most customers in West Hollywood area get it within like 20 minutes or 10 minutes sometimes if Postmate's not slammed, right? Um, other than that, if you guys found it informative, give it a thumbs up. I'll see you guys soon. Have a great day. Cross your fingers. Bye.